Hey everybody, it's Ryan Dorn, and today in our SEO section of our monthly e-newsletter, we're actually going to talk about quality SEO, quality search engine optimization. And so, as I've shared with you before, the way that it always starts is like a three-sided uh, triangle. And it's the top of the triangle, in my opinion, is having a quality website. And I think whether you're Matt Cutts, the uh, chief spam cop there at Google, um, he's always talking about the fact that quality websites are so important. And if you run a quality website, Google is going to reward you. The other two things that I've really noticed is I've noticed that Google likes it when you have a lot of really quality links to your website. Basically, what's that all about? What that means is basically that you've got a bunch of folks that are linking to you saying, hey, we also acknowledge that you have a great website. Some people have taken this to the wrong extreme, and they have a lot of folks that are linking to them that, that don't really matter. The other side of the triangle is chatter. Chatter out there on the Internet. And what does that mean? That means other people than you talking on social media sites, uh, doing comments, making mentions, etc., in videos about you and your website. Today we're going to focus in on links. And I think overall it's really important for you to fundamentally understand who is linking over to you. So I want to show you how that works, okay? All right, so I'm just re over at regulargoogle.com. And what I've done is I've um, we're going to actually put into the Google box to show you how many people are linking to you. So I want to see how many people are actually mentioning the LA Times. Now, what I'm doing is this is different than a backlink checker. Okay, there's a lot of what we refer to as backlink checkers out there. What I want to know is how many people have mentioned latimes.com on their website. This isn't necessarily showing you how many people are linking to you, but typically, okay, if your .com name is mentioned on a website, in almost all cases, it's usually a link. Remember something, there's a lot of backlink checkers out there. Be wary of those because a lot of times the results you get are not very good. So out on the web, there's right here, look here, there's 16,800,000 citations or mentions of latimes.com out on the internet. Okay. Now let's just go ahead and punch in uh, you know, a smaller uh, magazine. Uh, that Let's go ahead and punch in, uh, for example, let's go punch in uh, my friend up at uh, Holistic Horse Magazine. Okay. All right, and so you'll notice that at holistichorse.com, she acts wow, pretty good. She has 10,800 mentions of holistichorse.com and other websites. How do you know what are the other websites? Scroll down the page, okay? So you'll notice that there's a holistichorse.com.au, okay? There's a mention over at Keyword Spy. Let's scroll down, okay? She's also got a mention here over at Rocket Theme, uh, Forum Flash Load, Directory.yahoo Business, okay? She can go on to the next page here and look and see. Okay, web stat checker, uh, twitter.com. Oh, look here, we're on YouTube. Okay, so here's some of the, the mentions of her on YouTube. I wanted to show you this because I think it's really important. One of the things that's a great, one of the ways to get some good SEO results is to have a lot of videos on YouTube. A little tip though, make sure that you actually put your web name. Now, what she's going to want to do is add the HTTP in front of this, www. And that's actually going to make a link within. Um, you know, the YouTube interface, and I think that's great. So remember, as we talk about quality SEO, you need to know how many times you're being mentioned all across the Internet. So remember, links to your website are really important. So the interesting thing about what I showed you today is it gives you the ability to very accurately see what other websites are actually featuring your .com name on their website. Okay? So again, it's very simple to do. You simply put your .com name in quotes, no www, and then click the advanced search box. So if you're looking for more thoughts or helps on the, help on this, I'd really encourage you to give us a call. Um, our first 45 minutes uh, together is always absolutely free of charge. And this is the, the beginning of massive research we can do to help you have perfect SEO on your website. I think all of us realize that without great SEO, it's very difficult for you to be found on the Internet. And because there's so many... You know, like two guys in a garage that are building websites to compete against our publications and businesses. It's really tough to, to stay up and ahead of the curve of what's happening. We want to help you do that. And that's why we've got a team of people here at Brainswell dedicated to SEO, specifically for business owners and publishers. Hope this has been helpful. Take care and good luck. If you need some help with your SEO, feel free to reach out to us and give us a call. This is Ryan Dorn from Brainswell Media signing off. Until next time, thanks so much for stopping by.